Bruce was a very kind man. He really treated everyone equally. He never looked up, he never looked down to people. He looked everybody straight across. Doesn't matter what your ability, what your nationality, nothing. You know, when you walk on the streets in Hong Kong, you see a number of uh, unfortunate people who are having a hand out. He always had a coin for people, always. All the people that worked on the sets of his films, you know, they're from low down to high up and in their uh, positions. And he treated everybody the same. Always called people by name, always was there, can I help you out, can I do something? Always being a comedian with them, telling jokes and doing magic tricks. He was always doing something funny. I remember sitting up one whole entire night, whole night, with Ralph Castro in San Francisco, who was a karate man. And uh, that everyone who was there was just telling jokes back and forth all night long. And just that's the way Bruce was, just very, very entertaining, very kind, uh, but always a nice kind of humor too. He didn't put people down or anything like that. You know, the person that he was in the films is very much like the person he was. Very dramatic, very bigger than life. And even in some of the films, you see the comedic side of him, right? Bruce uh, was always saying, hey, come here, can you stand like this? And here, let me do this and that, you know. And so he was always trying out some new technique on me. And then, of course, the guys, all the guys were at our house all the time because uh, they, he, Bruce had his school down in Chinatown, but then after that, the guys would be at our house, and there was always martial arts going on. We talked about martial arts every day, <laughs> day and night, every day. 24 hours a day. 24 hours a day, that's right, yeah. When I first met him, I started taking Kung Fu lessons from him. and. Um, it wasn't long before I was more interested in the teacher than in the lessons, you know. Yeah, and you know, I have to add to that. I think the word, a word that describes Bruce is um, focus. He focused on what he wanted to do. He was not distracted by other things or other interests. That was it. And in order to achieve and excel at something, you really have to focus on it. And he had that ability. You know, when you say focus, Bruce Lee could have took another job and he could work anywhere. You know, I think his last job was dishwasher, right? Oh, uh, he, he used to make the wontons in a Chinese restaurant. He used to make wontons and he used to stuff newspapers. He did a lot of odd jobs. This was before we got married. But, but when he focused, he didn't want another job because that's going to that's gonna distract him from his goal. So that's 100% focus when, you know, he got to make ends meet, but he still worked on, on his career and, and his goal, and that's why he's successful.